Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the Super Mario Odyssey playthrough. Last time we started the Seaside Kingdom. We're uh, trying to uncork all of these fountains. Um, we have two more we have to uncork and then we have to take care of uh, that guy there. Um, before we do though, um, I need to warp back to where I was, which I believe I was over here. So we're going to go ahead and go over here first and see what other things we can find. We'll probably be using quite a bit of the Gushens as well, which are the, uh, th those guys. <laughs> if it wasn't clear. Uh, but before we do, I think I did see some, like, purple coins over here. Yes, I did. I want to grab these first. Grab it, thank you. I think there were some other ones over here too. We were just finding like a whole bunch of them. Yeah, there's some down there. It seems like there's something also kind of hidden in this little spot right here. Just coins, fine. Be that way, game. Be that way. Oh, shoot. I didn't realize my meter was that low. Thankfully, it didn't matter. <laughs> okay, up to 58. Just checking around just to make sure. Yeah, Saint Side Kingdom is another kingdom that can be kind of awkward to find all the regional coins because they can just be like randomly stashed in like certain places. So you do have to kind of be on the lookout for them. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, I think I remember this. This is like a moon shard puzzle. We won't have Cappy with us though, so we need to be a little quick about this. I mean, really, this is no different from the aquarium and... God. Oh, okay, maybe with less eel, with more eels this time, but like the aquarium in Mario 64 where it's just like swim around and grab things. Okay. Man, these eels. What is with Mario, 3D Mario games and eels? <laughs> It's like, we want to make that the big threat <laughs> in Mario 3D games. Eels underwater. Not like sharks. No, save the shark for Banjo-Kazooie and like Treasure Trove Cove, but... No, a giant eel instead. Okay, I want to say that's it. There might be... I guess there could always be something else in here, but... So I'm not seeing it. I'm kind of trying to turn the camera around while I'm doing this, just to be sure. Okay. So it looks like the game wants me to go up there next. And there is, like, kind of like a secondary area that's, like, over here. Where the game's like, hey, look at all this other stuff you can do. Okay, that was weird. Like, it wouldn't let me use Cappy. I guess I, I guess he, Cappy was still on the uh, Scarecrow or something. Okay, that was really weird. I know there's coins down there, that's fine, but 
there's moons here, and I'm more interested in moons right now. I'm sure I'll be interested in coins later, though. Oh, there's the other seed. Um, kind of wish I would have <laughs> done all this other stuff first. I mean, we do have, uh, I guess we do have, like, uh, some checkpoints, so it's not a big deal. Man, we're up to 70 now. That's pretty good. Shows that we're doing pretty good with uh, getting everything. I think we're doing pretty good. Maybe, maybe you guys don't think so. Maybe you guys think I'm like faffing around like a weirdo or something. I don't know. Maybe I need to give myself more credit. Okay, another another long walk of shame to the uh, <laughs> to the resort rooftop, so we can plant one more seed. Probably get another moon because the next one's planted. Oh no, not yet. Okay, some of these do grow like faster than others. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, I gotta land. That's another weird thing. You gotta, like, if you make a jump like that, you have to land before you can warp. I think it's because, like, they don't want you to, like, jump off the ledge into an endless abyss and then it's like, oh, hey, I, I, I saved myself. <laughs> when in reality, you really didn't. But it's all good. It's all good. Ah. Yo! Hey, pretty lady! Oh, right. <laughs> oh, right, you only like Goombas. <laughs> I thought she looked pretty. She, she looked dignified. If I was into Goombas, I'd, I'd, get, I'd get her a juice. Like, you know. You go out for a juice sometime. Okay, above Rolling Canyon. Oh, Rolling Canyon indeed. I feel like you do need to get like a gushing in there too, because there was like a some water. So maybe I maybe I should bring a gushing through there at some point. Slam. And welcome to the jam. Damn it, I hate Space Jam! <laughs> How could you hate Space Jam? Like, there might be something up there. I'm gonna go back through here really quick just to see if there's like anything else I can notice. Cause like, what is the point of that water right there? Also needs some Goombas. Which, there's some Goombas here. Okay, you know what? I'm feeling like playing matchmaker. They have to be careful because... <laughs> I think if you get hit, like... You'll lose Goombas. Oh, you can also dash with Goombas. So yeah, we have to be a little careful. Ah! Ah! <laughs> hey, pretty lady! You like five Goombas? <laughs> yes, I do! <laughs> Oh my god, okay. Well, <laughs> love by the seaside. <laughs> oh my god. Ow! Oh, that hurt. Oh, oh, and I just killed one of the Goombas now. <laughs> okay, well, I feel bad. <laughs> okay. What can I do now? I think I have like one more to get, and it's like the one that's like on a ledge. 
Which I think you can just use the Gushins for, which I guess we might as well go get them now. We can gush around some. Where are they? I think they're more like over here. I hope they didn't like disappear or anything. Uh, I want to say this is just... There's a glowing spot, but I think it's just... Oh my god. I, I thought there was a glowing spot, but... No, there is. There totally is. Um, why? Just coins, wow. And here I thought that was something relevant and important, but apparently not. Okay, gushing. Gush, gush away. Gushing away. <laughs> oh yeah, that is something. You have to, like, manage your water a little bit, too. I think Oh wait, I was just up here. I'm sorry. <laughs> this was where I was trying to go. Crap. overlooking the beach. Sounds fun to me. Okay, we did already find that, so we're good there. I do want to check that out, but before I do... And 82 coins. We'll definitely have fun in the shop when we get around to it. Okay. Let's go inside this bonus area. Oh, and of course, we get to use the gushums for this too, which is perfect. anything yet. Treasure chest in the narrow valley. Um. Oh, well, is there something here? Oh, there's another one. Okay, I guess these. This is both of them. Fly through the narrow valley. Okay. I I guess that's it. Um. Hold on. Oh, well, they weren't purple coins, but they were coins. <laughs> so yeah, I think that's it. There, I mean, I guess there could have been purple coins in there, but I don't think there are. It sucks that I don't have the gushins again, so now I have to go get them, but... At least I can just warp there or something. 
I want to play volleyball right now. Oh, there. Okay, there's the Gushens. They were just chilling. Which, hey, big mood, honestly. Big mood. Okay, hold on. Come here. There we go. Ride the jet stream. Remember through the jet stream? Those missions in Mario 64? That's what that reminds me of. Okay, what do we got now? Is this water or... Okay, no, these are clouds. Or mi misty... Mists of cloud or something. They can use these to kind of uncover the area around. see two paths up here. One's probably the secret moon. Ouch. Oh, come on! I, I thought I was going to wall jump against that wall, but I guess not. Well. I think this was where I died. treasure in the cloud sea. Yeah, I guess I, guess I was kind of sunk in with those clouds. I do have, I do like how those things are kind of like they work with all the other ones. Kind of a neat little effect. It's like activating one will activate the other one, which could activate the other one again, so they never stop. It seems like such a waste of, like, energy, though. <laughs> okay. I think we can probably get the last fountain, though. Which, I think we can just jump up there. With the gushin. Ow. Jerk. Whee. Well, look at that. That was easy. I think that's supposed to be the first one to get because all you need to do is just get the enemy and then just jump in there. But, yeah, well. It's too late now. And pop goes the octopus. You thought it was Weasel? You're wrong, it was octopus. Okay. So now we gotta fight this guy. And thankfully, we do have a nice way we can fight him. Gushens will cooperate. So notice how um, this guy has lava on his head. Oh, 
Well, now he doesn't, but... <laughs> now his head is... nice and clean. Come on! I think you're supposed to like ground pound them or something. I mean, I, I, I assume that's what we'd have to do. Actually, maybe you can still use the gushing, actually. I think you can still use the gushing. Yeah. Also, for some reason, this octopus guy kind of always reminds me of, like... I don't know what they're called, but, like... There was always, like, this little, like, octopus-looking guy that was also purple that I used to have, like, in bath time when I was a kid. I don't remember, like, the brand name or what that octopus was called or whatever. That's it. Oh no, he exploded! <laughs> Did the water start seeping into his head or something? <laughs> I guess. Okay, well there we go, we got it. After we take a look what's down here. Ooh, a painting, which we can't do yet. Because I think we have to finish the world before we get this. So I want to say it does go back to an older kingdom, so... The glass is half full. Is it, though? Is it? Is it, though? Is it half full or half empty? <laughs> Trivia question in the comments. No. <laughs> My goodness, what a pretty sunset. And it's so nice that the fountains and the sparkle water are back. But it doesn't seem like Bowser is in this kingdom anymore. Shall we head to the next? I guess. After we have some fun. Uh, first thing I want to do is I actually want to go back. Because I think the painting is available now. I think you just have to get the multi-moon first. I'm pretty sure, anyway. Yep. That? That's either Snow Kingdom or Lake Kingdom. Sure, it's one of those anyway. It's Light Kingdom. Okay. Grab this. Grab this. And you know what? While I'm here, I think there is something I'm going to take care of really quick. Because we're in the second area, right? It does seem like we are. Okay. Well, uh, we do have some more hint art. That's the reason why I want to go back here. And I, I think this is one of the kingdoms where we did get all the purple coins, so we can also do that. Like, purchase everything, so... Kind of want to just get things done, I guess. So yeah, let's go back to the... main part of this area. Then we'll go pull up that picture we found earlier. Um, a 
Okay, so it's right there next to a hole and next to, like, a pillar thing. This? Yep, there it is. Found with Metro Kingdom art. Yay, we found it. Okay, that was that was easy. <laughs> that was easy and nice. Um, also, I believe... I think I already did this, though. Did I do that? I'm pretty sure I did. That seems like something I would do and take care of. But, um, I don't think we've done this yet. We have this long, deep tunnel we can go all the way down for. And yep, even, even Cappy thinks this is pretty deep. I probably could have also used a cheap cheap for this. <laughs> Captain Toad! Swimming with this backpack is tough. I don't even know how I made it here. <laughs> oh, but I discovered this power moon. Here, you can have it. Man, you got lucky that you didn't drown. I guess maybe the backpack probably slowed his descent or something. Or sped up his descent. Or actually, I don't know. It may have, like, treated it like it's like, oh, hey, this you'll float, so... I don't know. Basically, he's lucky to be alive. That's what I'm getting at. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh. There's a seed? Yeah, there's a lot of things we have to do here. Well, for now, I'm going to go ahead and purchase everything in this shop. I guess I'll do this as the final thing, just to kind of show the process here. But once you get all the uh, regional coins, you can pretty much clean out the purple coin shop. And you can buy, like, all these mementos and stuff. So, we got those. And now we're going to just very quickly go back to the Odyssey. And some of the things you can buy are like little decals that you can find on the Odyssey. Yeah, Lake Lamode. And then if you go on the inside, I think you can see some of the figurines and stuff, so. It's basically all that is. They don't really do anything, but I think you do need to purchase them all if you do want to get like 100% in this game. But yeah, um, that's going to be it. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Um,. Let me just warp back here and go back to the uh, lakeside or seaside kingdom. I don't know how much more I can do here. I'm, I'm sure there's a lot because, again, it's a big kingdom. But, again, I feel like I was pretty thorough with getting a lot of different things. So, I may actually move on. But, um, yeah, there's probably some small things I can do. And if I do manage to find everything, maybe I can just go back to one of the other kingdoms and do a little more work there. I don't know. I don't have to necessarily keep moving on. But we do have another big kingdom coming up as well. Uh, but for now, this has been uh, Slim Kirby. This has been Super Mario Odyssey. Thank you guys for watching. I'll uh, see you guys for the next episode. Later, folks. <laughs>